uh, that Ranko loves to use. Uh, Ike's not honestly a real character. He just has an air and great follow-ups into an air, which are so much scary. Uh, biggest thing you're going to have to learn is how to play around that. Um, with Ike versus, uh, what, Meta Knight, assuming that Edge Knight's going to play Meta Knight, it's going to be a hard situation to see if uh, Edge Knight's going to have any opportunity to get in because, um, what, he doesn't have any good long disjoints. The best thing he's going to have to do is uh, use his speed to maybe try to get around it. Um, the biggest thing that could, uh, it's going to help out Edgy Knight is if he's able to edge guard Ike. With such a linear uh, recovery and the ability to go so far off stage, it's going to be uh, really advantageous if Edgy Knight's able to go off up against Rango. S controllers are set. Looks like probably going to Gentlemen's to PS2. And they are going for uh, not the best song. Hello, hello, uh, hello, hello. Magnesium on the mic, Magnesium commentating the mic. for uh, Rango and Edgy Knight. Yes, Edgy Knight being uh, in a crew called Easy Money, and Rango. I, I, don't, I don't know. He might be sponsored. Uh, <laughs> he, he he was sponsored by uh, Olympic Esports okay. like uh, in the past, but I'm pretty sure that he's no longer affiliated with them. Oh, okay. So. I, uh. I, I know from experience that uh, Edgy Knight is a Meta Knight and Isabel main. That is an interesting combination. Yeah, so, however, he, j he prefers to play Isabel because he just likes the character. Oh, that's yeah. uh, All right, so game one, we got Rango uh, going in on uh, uh, Starting off Isabel. strong yeah. with some meaty hits. Putting Edgy Knight in the corner. Okay, so let's see what he is able to do to answer to Rango's problems. Mm, has to be careful throwing out moves like that. Yeah. And also the fact that Rango just... Ooh! That's already getting that, dead. Getting that. Gosh. Getting that up air against Isabel. Not, yeah. a, not a good thing due to the fact that Isabel being a lightweight. Mm, yeah. Biggest thing you have to do when you're playing up against Ike is just get away from yeah. that nair. That nair falls up into so many moves. It's real scary. S sadly, sadly, Isabel... I, this could be a hard matchup for her since she is fighting a sortie. Yeah, I understand his pick. Uh, he wanted to maybe space him out, but Ike is so much faster than people anticipate right. when they go up against him. You know, he can really actually break uh, guard a lot better. Yeah. Uh, Edge Knight maybe getting something starting right now. Right. Ah, oh. gets in there. Yeah, pokes out his down. Ike. Re Rango being able to gain center stage and getting that kill with a back air against Edge Knight. Gosh, such powerful moves. Indeed. Edge Knight trying to figure out a game plan or something, but he's just slowly yeah. spacing out the Rango and you know, dwindling his shield a bit, but not enough to uh, keep enough pressure while Rango is putting on the pressure against Isabel. Yeah, right? it's uh, really scary when you go up against an Ike because you don't realize that the Nair is actually safe on shield. Alrighty, we have Isabel planting the Lloyd Rocket, trying to get some ledge trapping going on, but... Unable to land. Yep. Gosh, it looks so oh! hard. He really went for it. Oh my he god, he really went for it. That's so delightful. No! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Throw out a move. Oh no, Isabel. <laughs> you know, although although I do follow an account called various uh, medias of Isabel being hurt, but... You know, oh, that's horrible. Yeah, yeah but, but like... What? Yeah, it's funny. But uh, <laughs> but I don't want to see my friend getting That's smashed. sadistic. That's a, oh, oh, no, they have to get that kill. Tilt. Dominating three stock right. from Rango. Rango getting that clean three stock. Putting yeah. the insane pressure. Will we see a potential character switch? Who knows? However, Edgy Knight's does have a lot of tricks. Oh, he's switching the uh, the little plushie that he has over there. Uh, does that mean a char oh, that, character? Is that indicative switch? of a character, character switch? Character switch? Will we see the Edgy Knight playing his natural character? Meta Knight. Ed yeah. <laughs> Meta Knight is an Edgy Knight. Who, who, who picks the name Edgy Knight and goes Isabel? Uh, That's the biggest troll I've ever I heard. Of. I don't know. <laughs> as you can tell, Edgy Knight is a man of culture as he goes to uh, Zelda, picks a wonderful song. Indeed. I appreciate that. All right, game two. He even goes to the Edgy Knight. He, he, oh, he wait. even goes to Edgy Meta Knight. Oh, yep. Well, the Edgy Meta Knight is like the, the darker one. True, with yeah. the scar over his eye. Yeah, yeah. All right, so we okay. see Edgy Knight. This time around, he's trying to space <laughs> Ooh, in and out. Ooh. Okay, interesting. Okay. 
Edgy Knight trying to uh, space in and out of Rango's uh, moves. Mm -hmm. Game one looking very dominant for Rango. However, Edgy Knight does have a lot of tricks up his sleeve as he is a Meta Knight main as well. Meta Knight, although not too great in this iteration compared to uh, Smash 4. Well, it depends. But, but still, Meta Knight does have tricks. And this is, this he, match and is definitely going a lot better. Oh my yeah. god. Okay. Goes deep for it. Uh, uh, he went deep for that. I got a that. game to play. Alrighty. Okay. So, here we have Edgy Knight. And uh, here we have a friend of mine. His name's uh, Ace. Okay. OTG Tico uh, in the mic. Yeah, what's up? All right, so currently we see Ed Edgy Knight trying to get back to center stage. However, the percentage looking in Edgy Knight's favor. Ooh, good good stage control to uh, his part. Getting that down smash against uh, Rango. However, Rango getting that grab and now securing center stage for himself. Edgy Knight, oh, oh, Edgy Knight with that. a clean down B. Yeah, getting, he does love that. He does indeed love that. Now he has to try to stay safe to, um, yep. against that. Oh, that, that, uh, that, that, that didn't look too nice. That dash him. attack <laughs> killing Edgy Knight right away. Rango saying, I'm not having enough. I'm not having, you know, any of that. <laughs> I appreciate how Edgy Knight's being pretty patient, and, um, and when he gets in, he's actually aggressive with yeah, it. Yeah, he actually yeah. keeps the pressure on. Okay, Rango doing the same thing. However, Rango's trying to space out Edgy Knight. However, Edgy Knight trying to find an opening to get into. Okay, Rango with the onslaught okay. of forward airs. Ooh. Okay. Seemed like it was a misplacement for his down B. Yeah. Uh, how unfortunate. Ooh. The percentage not looking too good for Edgy Knight. However, you know, Meta Knight does have options okay, nice. to work with. Oh, uh, that back air nasty killing. back air right oh. there. Ike being such a dominant character in this game compared to his Smash 4 counterpart, whereas in Smash 4, he did take um, he did he it, it did take a bit for him to uh, get secure stocks and um, gain leads and whatnot. However, this time, Ike's sword is it's, uh, it's just a giant hitbox. It's crazy. Oh, that super. Oh wait, that's super armors. Yeah, I'll be. I think it always had super armor in it. That's weird. I never, I never knew that actually. Okay, Edgy Knight going for the the jab punish. However, Rango being able to read that. Oh, that was Ooh, a nice one, right? Nice there. down smash. However, Edgy Knight losing stage control. Okay, he's, he's not looking too nice on him right now. He's yeah. getting getting slapped around. All right, but he's slow. He's oh, slow. Oh, he tried it again, but nope. it didn't. Nah. And F tilt as a punish. Ooh. Okay, Edgy Knight continuously trying to land his land his down B. But Rango being able to retaliate. Oh, oh no! Ooh, that that, uh, that could have been punished, but yeah, that could have been very deadly. Okay, he's trying to read some. Oh, oh my God! Okay. An insane down B confirm. I guess, <laughs> well, not confirm, but well, he got to be careful now. He yeah. really got to play patiently. Just keep, got to keep him out. Yeah, keep Ike out. Edgy Knight just needs to just, just play, play around. Patiently. Play around Ike's massive, massive hitbox. Oh, and, and that, that neutral air to up air getting that kill. That was a nasty up air, but at least he got him down to one stock. Right. He didn't get swept. Yo, I feel like he should have just stayed uh, Meta Knight. He played 